I'm Melissa. Thank you for stopping by my channel. Today we're going to be doing this makeup look, which is a St. Patrick's Day inspired look, but we're using the Morphe Jaclyn Hill palette. So keep watching and don't forget to subscribe for more makeup tutorials and product reviews. I have already moisturized my face and now I'm going in with Make Sense Silk Pore and Wrinkle Minimizer. I have been using this product daily and I'm absolutely loving it. It is a primer, but it's very moisturizing. It just feels so nice on your skin. Next, I'm going in with the Natural Color Concealer from Senegents. And this I'm going to apply underneath my eyes and a little bit also to get rid of some redness. And I'm just blending in with my Beauty Blender. And for foundation, I'm applying some Clinique of Buttermilk Beyond Perfecting. This is just a super amazing foundation that has great coverage. I'm also just going to add some brows using Maybelline's Brow Precise Micro Pencil. I'm applying Cover FX Anti-Age Smoothing Eye Primer. I'm going to be using the fabulous Jaclyn Hill Morphe palette today. I'm starting by applying a little bit of In Light all over. So I'm going to do some green vibes for this makeup look so that it could work for St. Patrick's Day but it's going to be a little bit more subtle so it's not like a super in your face bright green St. Patrick's Day look. So and next, I'm going in with Silk Cream in the transition area. And I'm using Enchanted, which is a dark forest green in the crease with the Sigma Diffused Crease E38 brush. And I'm also going to work some of that green underneath the eye also. Next, I'm going in with Diva, which is a metallic shimmering green on my eyelid. It's interesting because it doesn't really look that much lighter than the color in the crease, which surprises me. It's basically the same color with metallic. I'm going to use a little abyss right in that outer corner to just deepen it up a little. And that abyss just looks gorgeous, layered over Enchanted. I'm picking up some Obsessed and applying that underneath the eye towards the inner corner and also up into the inner corner. I'm using Lash Extend, which is a black liner that also helps grow your lashes. And I'm just applying that on top only. And with this product, you do have to give it a minute to dry. I'm applying a little bit of Too Faced I Want Candy Banana Pudding Face Powder. And I just kind of apply this on my nose, my cheeks my chin, and my forehead. And this powder is awesome because it actually has these different light reflecting pigments to just make your skin look more perfect. And I'm using my Becca Chrissy Teigen palette, which I love to apply some bronzer, blush, and highlight. I added some Kiss Lash Couture Triple Push-Up Camisole Lashes. And I'm also using some of the Clinique Bottom Lash Mascara on my bottom lashes. And for lips, I'm going to try this Vice Urban Decay Lipstick that I got sent. And it is Conspiracy and it is a metallic lipstick. Very cute packaging. There is the color. It looks like a pretty brown sugar type color. Okay, I was totally wrong. It's more of a mauve. Mm -hmm. 
So this lip color is called Conspiracy. I would describe it as a metallic raisin with a really pretty coppery gold shift. So here is our final makeup look. Rockin' some Major Green from the Jaclyn Hill Morphe palette. But it's not like an in-your-face St. Patrick's Day look. I feel like it's like a little bit more of a forest metallic look, a little bit maybe not really more subtle, but a little bit different than I feel like that bright green. Definitely a look that would be good for like a night out kind of thing. And also a loving this lipstick. It's really pretty, I like how the metallic goes with the metallic green eye. Thank you so much for watching this video. Let me know in the comments below what your St. Patrick's Day plans are and if you'll be rocking some green eyeshadow. Also, let me know if you've tried the Jaclyn Hill Morphe palette or if you've tried this Urban Decay Vice lipstick. I hope you have a fabulous week, have a happy St. Patrick's Day, and I will talk to you soon. Give me a thumbs up if you liked the video. Please subscribe and I will see you next time.